Hello again my friends, so let's have a look at Bungie's latest tweet. It says, even in the darkest night, you can shine through the dawning themed armor acquired from Treasures of the Dawning. So let's have a look at this armor in more detail. Here we have the gauntlets. Here we have this super distinctive looking helmet. It's really gorgeous. There's nothing like this in the game. I really like the design and I really like the colors. And here we have the chest piece. Now, if the tweet says that you can only get this armor through Treasures of the Dawning. And now when you heard that, alarm bells probably went off in your head. Is this armor set going to be locked behind a paywall? Can Treasures of the Dawning only be purchased for real cash or can you also acquire them for free? Now these are questions that we don't yet have the answers to. Now in a previous tweet, Bungie said that every day from December 13th to January 3rd, you can find new gifts from city citizens to open in the tower. Now will these gifts also contain Treasures of the Dawning? If so, that means you'll be able to have a chance of getting this new armor set for free. Otherwise, you're going to have to pay to buy Treasures of the Dawning. So this will be locked behind a microtransaction wall if that's the case. But like I said, we don't yet know if that's the case. Bungie has to be more transparent and let us know about Treasures of the Dawning. Can they only be purchased via cash or can you get them for free? This is something that we have yet to find out. We're now going to look at the gorgeous new artwork that Bungie kindly sent my way. Now, if we zoom in, we see just how distinctive this Hunter armor set is. I just hope it's not locked behind a paywall. If we zoom in further still, we see the Year 3 Icebreaker. Now, this is an absolute beast of a weapon, and I cannot wait to get my hands on it. It's without question my favorite PvE exotic in the entire game. Now, Icebreaker is also coming with two new ornaments. The ornament that you see here is called Nano Nanohance and it turns the Icebreaker white. The other ornament is called Dune Marcher and that gives the Icebreaker a nice camo skin. So let's zoom back out and focus on these two guardians right here. Now the guardian on the left is holding the Nova Mantis which is a new void heavy machine gun. It's basically the void version of Thunderlord and the guardian on the right is holding the Abaddon and that's basically the solar version of the Thunderlord. Both are two new heavy exotic machine guns and you need to complete two new exotic quest lines to get your hands on them. So that's definitely something to look forward to. Let's scroll down. Just check out that fucking cape. It's fucking amazing. Should I, I should say cloak, not cape, but you get my drift. It looks fucking amazing. Check out the belt AK-05. No idea what that fucking means, but let's scroll down further still and here we go, Sparrow Racing League. Now we're going to look at the two new Sparrow Racing League tracks in just a moment so definitely stay tuned for that and if we go over to the left here and zoom in we see the gifts we're going to get one free gift every single day that the dawning is actually going on for so that's quite a few free gifts let's just hope they contain treasures of the dawning so that we can unlock this beastly looking hunter armor set right here so then what we're going to do now it's go sparrow racing join me so then there are two new sparrow racing league tracks and this is one of them it's called shining sands and it's set on mercury the other track is called hark and precipice and that's set on earth and that one is coming up in just a moment now you'll only see one lap for each of the new tracks as this will show you all the obstacles you need to avoid and all the boosters you need to hit. And I've got to say a huge thank you to Bungie for sending me this gameplay, much appreciated. So then my friends, enjoy the new tracks and we'll speak again at the end of the video. You got this, get out there and win. Cabal on the track, or as I like to call them, speed bumps. We're in the lead. Race isn't over yet. Catch up!
too. Keep it up. Splicers out there, Guardian. Ride safe. How's the sparrow running? So yeah, I hope you enjoyed that gameplay, and I've got to say again, a huge thanks to Bungie for sending that gameplay my way, it's much appreciated. Now guys, if you want to learn all about the new Sparrow Racing League book, and all the new loot that you can earn from completing that book, click the on-screen image, or follow the link that you'll find in the description box below. There's a heap more info in that video too, so well worth checking out if you want to learn more about the new Dawning event. And yeah, that brings us to the end of the video my friends, thumbs up if you enjoyed it, subscribe for daily Destiny content, and thank you so much for watching, you be you Beautiful bastards, and as always, her tee hee hee. Until next time, Guardians.